Victor Letabo is a designer, specifically of posters for Philippine cinema. So he was very prolific. In fact, he was the most prolific poster maker for film from the late 70s uh, through the 90s. Basically, he is a collagist, huh? but the medium was the poster. I think he's the most important uh, designer of posters for film of his generation and the most um, artistically serious in that discipline. The work of Vic de Lutavo uh, implicates the industry itself, Philippine film history, and also of the films made during the time, from the 70s to the 90s. Now, so it's a document of its time, at the same time that it is about itself as a visual form. De Lutavo reached a certain level of uh, artistic consistency and also well, we can say he, he took some risks in the design of posters that basically controlled by the industry. So he had also difficulty in trying to address the demands of the industry, specifically the star system and also the genre system. So while he was aware of these constraints, he was still able to um, work through them and assert uh, a level of artistic independence. So the exhibition titled Vic de Lotavo, Posters for Philippine Cinema, is a tribute to the work of Vic de Lotavo as a, a poster maker for, for film. It is likewise a tribute to the art of uh, the Philippine film poster. It's a dying or dead art because of the new technology in, in marketing or advertising of, of film. So it is a good opportunity to look at the discipline and the art of poster making for films in the Philippines from the 70s through, through the 90s uh, by way of the work of um, Big de la So I'd like to invite everyone, including Vic de Lotavo, <laughs> to come over to Vargas Museum and to view the exhibition which runs until June 9.